artistic family. Shannon Gibson Art Designs into a new adventure. So I've seen this a while ago and other artists have done this technique since, but it's called the ghost marble pour. Now I have used marbles in another pour. And when we say ghost marble, we're not talking about marble stone or faux marble like I create. Um, it's actually just creating um, a, an acrylic pour using marbles. I'm going to use my signature colors, which are gold, black, and white, and oftentimes silver and bronze and um, copper as an addition because I love my neutral metallics. So what I have is a very thick base of Artist Loft soft body black. It is a mound on a mound. So when your paints go in the cup, they form a mound and then another mound and they sit there a little bit before they go away. Now my recipe is different than what Denny Joe's is. I believe she's the one who started the coining the name of using a marble um, and satin enamel white as a ghost pour. So now that we have that all out the way, let's go ahead and get started. Spread this out. I'm not going to take it completely off. And uh, this is a complete experiment. So if it doesn't turn out to have little floaties on top, I'm happy because I'm using my favorite colors. I just love these colors. The contrast is absolutely stunning. And as always, shimmer makes me happy. I did get a little kind of ghosties there where you get that kind of wave, which is what you get from the satin enamel. But as I mentioned, I didn't use it. But I'm absolutely loving the patterns. 
And in some areas, I do see marble. I love the design. I absolutely love it. These are eye-catching and absolutely beautiful. And if they dry well, I will keep them for me. And I might set them in a little stand or I might actually frame them. Um, but I love these colors and they would look beautiful in my art studio. Again, I don't sell anything I re-pour on for obvious reasons. But anyways, guys, let me know if you guys love the design as well. I know you guys love my, the colors. You're my people. <laughs> so anyways, guys, thanks for being here. Until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you all in the next pour or painting.